If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that sub button for more amazing content. Now, let's jump straight into the video. What's good, YouTube? It's your girl, Bofita One, bringing you guys in another YouTube video. And today, I will discuss episode two of Citrus. So right off the bat, we see um, basically why Mai keeps pushing herself self up against Yuzi. Basically, many of the girls at the school are already engaged. Therefore, they're super eager to experiment amongst the other girls at the school before basically tie the knot with whoever that they're planning to be married with. Next, we see Yuzu um, basically embarrass her, her, not only embarrasses not only herself, but the chairman by calling him grandpa over and over and you know it, it basically doesn't sit too well with him because he doesn't know that they're they're related in any type of way and so he tells her to leave and he insults her outfits and you know why do you dress like this you know you're 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 disgraced to the school blah blah blah, blah. and so after she runs off now yuzu and her friend overhear the teacher that kissed mai that we saw in like the first episode and we, and we hear him talking on the phone he's saying basically that he's only pursuing my because of the money he knows that if he marries her he would be set for life and basically he's cheating on my with someone else he already has someone else that he's more interested in he just wants to get with her because the money and he can help his family so after that once they get back to the house once you get back to the house now um, she tells my about what she heard but my already knows and it seems to be she's showing little no interest at all like like basically it's like almost like she's just going through the motion and then the next day, Yuzu gets up in front of the school and exposes the teacher, Emma Mia, um, you know, for kissing a student and, you know, how it's kind of gross and disgusting. And after that, you know, she ends up getting in more trouble by the, by the uh, chairman. Then after that day is over, when she comes home that night, she sees her mom is crying at the table. She's like, you know, mom, what's wrong? Why are you crying? And it's because the grandfather came and took Mai. The grandfather wants Mai to have nothing to do with you. So she feels like, you know, he feels like she is just a whole bunch of trouble. She's no good. So he decided to take her from the house and bring her to his house. So... You know, after that, you know, she talks to the mom saying like, hey, you know, I'm going to speak to her and see if she wants to come back. How does she genuinely feel about it? So the next day, Yuzu approaches Mai about it. And basically, Mai tells her to leave her alone. But we all know Yuzu is pretty persistent. So she's going to keep going. So she ends up going to the grandfather's house and wondering why is she acting like this. And, you know, Mai kind of gets a little mad, a little fresh. We kind of see a little bit of tension there. And again, she starts pushing herself on Yuzu, you know, this whole like kissing scene and whatnot. And the grandfather comes in and is like, you know, you're always trouble. It's always you. It's always, you know, anytime people are around you, you're always just trouble. And she gets expelled from the school. And so basically after that scene, we see um, Yuzu is, is, is pretty hurt, you know, because she feels like she wanted to try to help her. Because, you know, if you guys haven't noticed, Mai seems very like, she puts on a big front. She, it seems almost as if she hates her life. You know, like she, because of her having this status and, you know, this chairman, she's related to the chairman, you know, like she has all this status. It's almost as if she hates her life because maybe she wants to be a normal kid. And so she has to put on this front at school. But then when she's, when she's home, she's like sad deep down the whole experimenting thing. I guess maybe that's what we heard in the beginning about how, you know, a lot of the girls are going to be married and they're going to tie the knot. So they're trying to experiment. But then part of me feels like there's also a deeper meaning with my as well. Um, but we have to probably wait and hear about that in the, in the future episodes. But to me, it's kind of just like, I don't know. It's just everywhere. And like I said, I feel bad for Yuzu because it's like, she didn't expect none of this. She didn't want none of this. And she's trying to be the good person, but she's ended up getting herself in more and more trouble. So we have to go basically wait and see what the next episode uh, entails. I did see the preview in the, at the end. Like it was like a what, 10, 20 second preview. And, and basically Maya tells Yuzu that the reason why she keeps kissing her is because it makes her shut up she stops talking so i don't know if that's something that maybe people do in her house i don't know if deep down she likes my i don't like i mean uh she likes you like i don't know what's going on like the show still has some like under underlining um issues that uh my has that it seems that we may or may not find out so the show still got me on you know my tippy toes i still want to know what's going to happen so let me know you guys thoughts down below in the comment section did you guys enjoy this episode did you think it was bad did you think it was good um what do you think is gonna happen in the next one? You know, do you think we're gonna find out genuinely why Mai is so sad all the time? Like, are we gonna find that maybe something about her household that maybe someone's abusive? Or, you know, we're gonna find something. Is she jealous? Is she jealous of Yuzu, maybe? You know, we don't know. So let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. As always, guys, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to drop a like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hope you guys have a good rest of your day, and I'll talk to you later. Peace, Fin Army.